Now this is an obstructive scan in the sense that I'm showing you the uterus of uh, the primary gravida and uh, she has, uh, pr uh, has positive pregnancy, beta ICG levels are raised. This is the uterus, this is the endometrial canal. We do not see any, this is the cervix, and we do not see any evidence of a gestational sac in this region. Now as I move the probe uh, transversely, we come across a cystic area which is seen relating to the right ovary. This is the right ovary and this is the gestational sac with broken irregular ecogenic rim around and this is the ectopic ovarian pregnancy uh, wearing 13.1 mm which is internally clear no uh, evidence of any uh, echoes and no fetal pole, nothing. Amenorrhea is that of uh, one and a half month or six weeks. This is the transfer section of the uterus. Yeah. Now, this, uh, why this is ovary? See, you will see other follicles developing also. One, two, three, four, um, within this uh, uh, this structure. And the second point to say why it is ovary is that the landmark uh, of the iliac vessel, this is the iliac vessel, is seen adjacent to it, you see. This is the iliac vessel. And now, so far as this uh, ectopic ovarian uh, pregnancy is concerned, uh, they, it shows no vascularity, bantorism. No, it's not taking any flow inside. And this is our case of the day that relates to the uh, ovary. So this is a case of ectopic ovarian pregnancy. Thank you very much.